Hello, I'm Jerry Ford, the beer review guy. It's Friday. I'm trying my my first outside video. Let's see how that goes. Hope the lighting is good. I I don't know. Um, I just getting ready to do this uh, about five minutes ago, and a blackbird decided to take a crap on my table, and it just it just splattered all over everything so I had to clean everything up before I could start this again but um so now where I'm ready again um, I have a good looking beer right here black sheep ale looks like a little over oversized bottle um, it's a pint crisp dry and bittersweet it says on it it says, uh, this, is, this is Black Sheep Ale, the culmination of, fine generation, of five generations of brewing expertise. Um, brewed at the Black Sheep Brewery in Masham, North Yorkshire. I don't know if I pronounced that right. Masham, Masham, North Yorkshire. And nowhere else. Paul... Fasoth? I can't read that. It's kind of in a. It's kind of in a, a like an old style cursive or something. Um, let's see. Product of the United Kingdom. Um, and that's about all it says on there. Let's see. There was a date on here. Saw it, but I can't read it. Actually, that may not be a date. Anyway, it looks really good. I'm anxious to check it out. I have uh, a little information here from from Rate Beer. The uh, commercial description it says bottle pasteurized. Um. <clears throat> Beers for bottling are drawn from brewery conditioning tanks and transported by road tanker to our bottlers. There, there they are chilled, stored for 10 days, then filtered and bottled. At the end of the bottling process, the bottles are pasteurized, labeled, and packed. Brewed with many generous handfuls of choice golden hops, it is full-flavored ale with a rich fruit nose. The bittersweet malty taste is followed by an uncompromising, long, dry, and bitter, bitter finish. This beer was the first most successful of all our bottled beers. So, it's a famous beer. Sounds really good, too. Um, this, the score, they gave it a 50 of overall and a 92 in style. So, that's not too bad. The overall is a little lower but uh, Beer Advocate gave it good scores of 84 and the bros gave it a 92 okay let's check this thing out wow Has a little bit of a of a uh, of a stout smell to it. <clears throat> Looks like it's all going to go in. All right, man, dark brown, kind of a. A dark tea color, half a finger ahead. <sighs> kind of, kind of got that dark fruit smell. A little bitter smell. Malty. <sighs> hmm. 
kind of a dirty sock, <laughs> dirty sock smell a little bit from the from the bitter from the bitterness. Hmm. Smells good though, besides the dirty sock. Let's see. Oh wow, that's different. Hmm. Wow, that's different. <clears throat> I ain't tasted one like that before. Huh. That is smooth. What is that taste? It's sweet. There's a sweetness to it. It says bittersweet. That's a pretty good description because it's sweet, but it's got that light bitter mixed in there. Huh. I wonder if that, that taste I'm getting is from the pasture, pasteurization. I don't know. Maybe somebody can, can enlighten me. Excuse me. On that. <clears throat> It may be the the process, but wow, that is really good. It kind of has a little bit of a toffee taste, a little toffee flavor. Kind of like caramely, maybe a little bit. It's got some sweetness in there, that's for sure. But wow, that's a smooth, that's a smooth beer. This is, forgot to, forgot to tell you, uh, it's a 4.4% ABV. Um, style is a bitter. <clears throat> okay. The head color, it was a, it was a, it was still a little bit there, kind of a khaki. Khaki off white color. The mouthfeel is a, is like a a sweet a sweetness at the beginning, and then it's got that bitter at the back end. It's good, really good. No wonder they they think a lot of this beer. That's good. I could drink. I could drink two or three, maybe four of these, being that low of uh, alcohol content or ABV, you could knock these back pretty easily. But, but anyway, yeah, this is good. Um, I'm sure my, my fellow UK reviewers have had this. I have not looked yet to see what it, what you guys have reviewed it as. I'd like to check those out. But let me know what you guys think of it. And uh, before I go, I got two new two two new uh, subscribers um, that I wanted to thank. Um, uh, Bob it Idland. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. <clears throat> Bob it, I D L A N D and uh, Satan Satan so thank you Bob thank you Satan for uh, for subbing me <laughs> I appreciate it um, so anyway we will end these this review and uh, it's nice out here today about 75 degrees so I'm gonna enjoy my evening and you guys all enjoy your Friday night see you on the next one Bye.